Thank you, Mr. Chairman, and thank you for your good work on this bill, and thank you, Mr. Speaker. I rise today in support of legislation that I'm proud to co-sponsor, the Tribal Labor Sovereignty Act of 215. It has long been a priority of this Congress to protect tribal sovereignty. These lands and their people should be free from bureaucratic intrusion as they are sovereign nations. However, the National Labor Relations Board has once again overstepped its authority to expand its jurisdiction over tribal lands, creating a cloud of uncertainty for tribal leaders. This legislation allows tribes to operate as they should, free from the threat of intrusion from the National Labor Relations Board. Much like states' rights, this legislation puts the power back in the hands of local tribal government so they can make decisions in their best interest. During a time of political and partisan gridlock, empowering tribes and lives of their people is a bipartisan issue that both sides should be able to find common ground on. We need to protect tribal lands from Washington's constant overreach. I will continue to work to ensure tribal sovereignty is not infringed upon, and I yield back the balance of my time.